Here's what I do on my days off training to make sure that my injuries don't get too bad that they get in the way of my goals and also just to manage my aches and pains. So it's Easter Sunday here in Australia. Happy Easter everybody. And today is my recovery day. And all I really do on a recovery day, it depends on how much time I've got. Sometimes I'll do a little bit of a longer workout and sometimes I'll do a shorter workout. But being Easter today, I've spent most of my day with my family and it's the afternoon. So I'm going to be doing a really short workout. And it's not even a workout really. I'm just going to be doing a tiny bit of foam rolling. And the main reason I do this, so I'm doing a thoracic extension here, is because this is an area that when this is tight, when you have restricted thoracic extension and you want to do movement training like what I'm doing, where you're doing you know, acrobatics and flow movements, and if you want to do things like back bridges, it really is going to you know, restrict your movement. And it also, it's something that becomes really, really tight from all the time we spend sitting down at the desk or in front of the TV or looking down at our phone. You know, we, we have this forward rounded posture. And so for me, if I do like a day where I'll do nothing, no movement, no exercise, no resistance training, I'll still do this little bit of foam rolling. And what I'm doing here is I'm interlocking my fingers behind my head. I'm trying to keep a relative a posterior pelvic tilt as much as I can because I don't want the extension to be in my lumbar spine. That's not helping my thoracic extension. And then I'm going to be pulling my elbows back as I extend my thoracic spine. So that's extension, that's flexion, okay? And then you can just move to different positions on your back. And you can also even... Um, bring your arms up like this and bring some shoulder flexion into it. And what that does as well, that actually adds a little bit of a lat stretch into the movement. And personally for me, any day where I don't do this, the next day I'll feel it. I just feel a lot more stiff and sore in my upper body. And because I've had slap tears in both shoulders, tight lats and just any sort of general disease up in my, you know, this area of my body is going to cause problems in my shoulders. And so maintaining flexibility, maintaining length through the pecs like this, like this, through the lats like this, and also thoracic extension like this is really, really beneficial. And in that amount of time, done daily or on a day where you're not doing anything else that is enough to really prevent my aches and pains from becoming too much and keep me moving forward towards my goal so i hope that helps you hope it gives you a little bit of an inspiration if you're watching this on easter to go ah oh, i'm just going to get up and do this one little thing that'll really help me tomorrow when i go and do my next workout happy easter everybody i'll see you in my next video